my name is Claudia. I'm uh, an artist based here in Brisbane and I'm taking you on a brief little tour of my studio today. So we're currently standing outside Greyhand Press, which is the uh, printmaking studio that I co-run. And it's also where I have my own personal practice as well. So Greyhand Press is a professional printing studio. So it is a collaborative space, uh, working with artists to create new work and also an educational facility as well, where we uh, can run workshops, one-on-one um, -on -one consultations and seminars for our students. So the studio is closed <laughs> to the public at the moment, but we are still here behind the scenes, um, creating new work and um, making new prints. Um, just here on the wall is actually a print uh, by one of our artists, Dylan Sara. He's actually part of the Kaya program at QCA and this is a beautiful wood intaglio uh, that we did with him last year called The Tale of Three Boomerangs and it's part of a much larger body of work that we're working on with him uh, now that we all have a lot more time to create new work. So uh, the coronavirus isolation period has been a bit of a blessing in disguise for me. Um, I've found myself with a lot more time to uh, not only make new work, but also conduct more experiments uh, with techniques and materials and um, taking the time to plan work for an upcoming exhibition at the Logan Art Gallery at the end of the year. So this is our press room. So this is where all the prints are actually made. Uh, and this here just in front is one of the stones that I'm working on. Uh, so I work with lithography. It's also what the studio specialises in. Um, and this is done on a slab of limestone. So lithography is a chemical printing process uh, based on uh, oil and water repelling one another. So the image is drawn directly onto the stone with grease and it's then processed with uh, gum arabic and nitric acid to create a stable image that can um, then be printed. So this image here is uh, one of the key layers for the series of work that I'm doing for Logan. Um, and I'm also working on uh, some plates as well. So the exhibition is looking at uh, landscape, um, particularly local landscapes in the Brisbane area. Uh, so jacarandas feature quite heavily uh, in my work. I'm quite interested in the sort of nostalgia and familiarity that are associated with jacarandas. So this is a technique called low shoe, uh, which is a negative wash technique that I use quite a lot in my work. So I'll take you upstairs to my other workspace as well and show you the sketches and uh, other pieces that I'm working on. So this is my other little sanctuary here. Uh, so this is where I do a lot of my drawing and image planning, carving, if I'm working on a, a wood block. It's also where I store a lot of my tools and um, little inspiration pieces as well. Um, so up here, I'll just show you the, the uh, sketches that I've got here. Um, so these are part of the uh, exhibition at Logan, looking at landscape, um, particularly looking at jacaranda blooms um, and the, the sense of identity that uh, Brisbane has with uh, jacarandas and the way they transform the city at certain times of the year. So this here is actually the the original layout for the stone that I showed you before. Uh, so the stone is just one layer uh, in this work. So we printed in uh, at least two colours and there'll be 50 to 100 individual impressions and then each of these will be cut out um, to form the installation work. Um, and then these are some of the original sketches for the um, low shoe plates, so the, the individual works that will be in the show. Um, so looking forward to seeing how this all comes together. Um, still got a little while uh, left until the show and a lot more work to produce, um, but looking forward to sharing little bits along the way. So thank you for joining this very brief little studio tour. I uh, hope everyone's uh, looking after themselves and staying healthy at the moment.
and look forward to catching up soon.